And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Paris Saint-Germain facing Manchester City. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Sergio Ramos in central defence and the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Emerson stands between the posts. Rodri plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the park. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway who will be crowned club kings of Europe. Messi. Cristiano Ronaldo. Messi. Opportunity here. And he succeeds in scraping it off the line. De Bruyne. It's a promising City move. Mares, Erling Haaland, oh, magnificent from the keeper, fantastic stop. Kylian Mbappe. Oh, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Ronaldo, now showing excellent vision. There it is, and he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Gundogan Ruben Dias Promising attack this Erling Haaland Oh a goal He's equalised Was he made for moments like this On an occasion like this Well here you can see what a good goal this is He hits it so cleanly And the keeper has no chance That's a great strike So 
So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Messi. Here's Ronaldo. Regained possession. Rodri. Now with Mares. De Bruyne. We're getting the ball forward. Mares! And there it is! They take command in the final. And just look at the celebrations here. Well, let's just take another look at this pass from Haaland. He has so much vision, and from that sort of range, Mares was never going to miss. It's a well-worked goal. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Ronaldo. And will it be the leveller? And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Now, options are plenty. Oh, in with a chance. And a goal! Well, as you can see again, De Bruyne plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders, and then Haaland finishes it with such quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal from a top-class player. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Ronaldo. lovely ball and the keeper has denied him well I've got to say Derek he was always in control of that situation brilliant stuff <laughs> they take it short Hakimi Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Could pull one back here. And putting his body on the line. Now keeper getting both gloves on the ball. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. And well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. And well, they've given him too much space. It's Neymar! Ronaldo! Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. The 
ball is moving again. The push is on from Paris Saint-Germain. Can they come up with an equaliser? Jack Grealish. Gundogan. Not a good pass. Neymar. Now with Ronaldo. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection. And he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Shy about shooting in this match. He's managed to lose his marker. Mares. John Stones. Here's De Bruyne. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been. The keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Well, you can't argue with those stats, can you? They've had good chances at both ends. The game is being played with great intensity, and it's been a pleasure to watch. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. Holland, and close but offside, nonetheless. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Messi. Neymar. Ronaldo. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Holland. He's in here. And denied by the post. No well, threat over for now. Well, I have to say, City are so unlucky not to be leading now. They look a real threat at the moment. Yes, so near indeed. But now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. De Bruyne. They might be able to get in now. And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Well, here's the replay. The pass over the top has just the right amount of pace on it, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Neymar. Soler on the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Ruben Dias. Akanji has it. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Ronaldo. This could level it. Oh, I can't believe it! Twists and turns in the closing stages. And it's anyone's guess who's going to lift the trophy. Incredible! Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and Ronaldo made the finish look so easy, as he so often does. It's a lovely goal. Oh, 
And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Holland. Can they push ahead in the closing stages? A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And tremendous defensive intuition from Sergio Ramos. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level, and extra time is coming up. Well, the ball rolling again, no end to the action. It's the first period of extra time, and I must say, this has been a back-and-forth type of game. A delicious piece of skill. Might take the lead. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. What a game we've had so far. Goals at both ends, some near misses as well, and some good individual displays. You can't take your eyes off of this. And he didn't hesitate. Good thing, too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. Verratti. Neymar. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. My goodness, the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper. Kevin De Bruyne. And Grealish. Grealish. And Bernardo Silva has it. Good physical play. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. A City free kick forthcoming. Played in there. Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Half time in extra time, and still they are level. Well, the second period of extra time commences. What drama do we have in store for us? Gundogan. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Cristiano Ronaldo. Here's Renato Sanchez. Tension building, still level. But really sticking to the task defensively. Stones. It's with Gundogan. Kevin De Bruyne. Grealish. On to De Bruyne. Gundogan. Must be! Oh, it's gone in for Manchester City! How about that? Near the end of this Champions League final. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. PSG 
energy chasing this game. Let's see if they can succeed on that front. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Time is against PSG, but they still have the ability to hit back. Oh, he's through here. And Neymar has done it. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. After 120 minutes, they cannot be separated. And so, in this Champions League final, it comes down to a shootout. And this will test the mentality of any footballer. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. I must say, that takes real confidence. Brilliant. So lethal in front of goal. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. I think we might just have witnessed the unstoppable penalty. And the keeper denies them from the spot. In it goes. Almost intolerable pressure. Low and accurate, that penalty. Well, a successful kick here, and that will be that. Well, what an ending to a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit, too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff.
The Champions League victors, Manchester City.